Hey everyone, so we're back in subsistence. I've been thinking about making a radiator and getting preparation for winter, which is still a couple months away, but you know, if you play the game enough, winter's going to come very soon. So I know I have enough metal ingots. It's the circuit boards that I'm going to need to get a lot more of. I need three of these. I need, uh, let's see, I have quite a few electrical components. Copper fragments, I know I have a lot of that. It's the pearls that I don't have a lot of. I only have two, so we're going to have to go out and start um, looking for some clams. We're going to have to do a little diving, do a little swimming. It looks like we have a band, a group of band, or hunters over there, roaming hunters. I want to stay away from them. They're just bad news. Yeah, I don't want to get in a fight. I try not to waste my bullets if I possibly can. Let's see. So yeah, I just want to try to look for supply bags and try to... Uh, I gotta get some clams. Let's see, it doesn't look like I'm finding very much there. I wish we had the ability to like create some underwater goggles, goggles or something so we could see. Hmm. Yeah, we're not getting any luck there. Alright, there we go. Yeah. Also thinking about extending my base. Making it a little bit bigger. A little bit more room. The longer I play, the more supplies I have. Just, okay, those are all off. I just want to make sure that they are. Clams, okay, let's see. There we go, first clam. Now, even though I have equipment for doing dives, uh, deep dives, um, that stuff, the, I mean, the air tanks go through so fast. They get used, they use up the oxygen tanks so fast. It's really, truly not worth it to to do it i'd rather much not waste my time trying to explore the very bottom and look for things i need there because uh, it's basically good for like a minute and a half oh <laughs> yeah forgot forgot i need oxygen talk about oxygen tanks and there i am just totally ignoring it All right. It looks like rutting season is over, so we don't have to worry about the uh, moose attacking us. I've had a few run-ins with the moose, and if you're close enough, I see usually they'll turn and start heading toward me during rutting season. A few times I've seen them like turn and run, which is kind of nice, because if I don't, I don't want to fight them. I really don't want to fight them. Uh, let's see. So what have we got? We got two. We need... If I can get at least two more pearls, then I should have enough pearls to um, at least make three circuit boards, which should allow us to make at least one radiator. And then we can try uh, turning off the... Um, turning off the wood burner and see I'll do that at night turn off the wood burner at night and then turn on the radiator and see how 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 much heat how far out it radiates heat and just how warm it gets you know do a comparison because it might make more sense instead of building radiators if it's going to be difficult to find enough pearls to make multiple radiators to just have multiple uh, wood burning ovens wood burners that's what they I think the game just calls it wood burner and have, have a wood burning oven up and running Let's see that's a bear up there okay I thought maybe it was a hunter and looked like there's a storage or a supply bag up there I would want to try to get but it's not worth it because right now the hunters are very close they're roaming hunters over there as you saw there's a hunting base 
hunter base over there. And I really don't want to have to uh, deal with that. Yeah, a wood oven might be uh, a wood burning oven or wood burning stove. What exactly would I call it? Might might turn out to be, you know, more uh, a better way of uh, of getting heat during winter than trying to get these uh, radiator going. I have no idea how much power the radiator will use. I'm sure there's a Wikipedia page that might explain it. Although I've gone to some of the Wikipedia pages that are available about this game and they don't necessarily give enough information in my opinion. All right, so we got four of them. It's looking okay. I'm just going to I'm going to do a little bit more hunting. Just a little bit more. We got about 25 more minutes left in the game and I wanted an opportunity to test this at night and see how warm it'll make uh how warm it'll make the base and how far the heat radiates so you know just have to wait with me while I try to get try to find some more clams oh man I think I could swim faster than this I think I could seriously I have to say, I'm not crazy about the water experience. In fact, I can't make a diving mess, so at least I can make things clear to see. I mean, if I could create a diving tank, why can't I put together a diving mask? Right, that might be... Oh, I think that's a clam way, way, way down there. And... We can get there we're probably going to use up most of our oxygen just getting down to it yep past the halfway point yep yep we're going to start <laughs> let's get it get going get going get going hit it twice crying out loud oh take a damage does anyone else see any more clams nearby Oh my lord. Taking damage. Taking a lot of damage. Well, that's not a lot of damage, but. Definitely taking some damage. Ooh, another clam. Yeah, so today is all about clams, man. I'm going to see how many pearls I can get my hands on. I think, I think I'll probably need, need like two of them. If I can get two radiators and put them at opposite ends of the base, that might be enough to keep the whole. Uh, main base level warm. I mean, I have a second floor, but oh my god, I have nothing on it. Yeah, I still have not put anything up there. I haven't made a bed or anything. I don't know if I really care for it. I mean, you can't really use it for for anything more than just respawns. You know, you don't sleep at night. In some games, you know, you can sleep through the night. You gotta kind of sleep through the night because your energy will you have an energy bar and that will wear off so you definitely gotta sleep I mean, I would think that that something that this game should should automatically have is, is that a clam I think that's a clam or is that a rock or an ore no it's a clam definitely a clam good yeah so some games um, they you gotta sleep you gotta be able to sleep to get your energy back and to me that's more realistic than kind of what subsistence is it really should add that to the game so that um, people can have something a little bit more realistic because sleeping is something you definitely have to do okay there's more clams over there good yeah I want to make two radiators if possible so we need a total of, let's see, yeah, two, four, six, then that's 12. We need 12 pearls to make two radiators. Yeah, at least one radiator would be nice. Yeah. 
I don't know what the respawn timer is on clams. If when I clear out an area, if I come back to it during the same day, if maybe maybe a new clam will have respawned in that area or not. I mean, there is some amount of respawn. I mean, some areas, if you go clear them out and then you leave to go to another area, they'll respawn. I don't know how long it takes, if it's like maybe a minute for items to start respawning or if it's almost instantaneous. I know some developers say that you know, when you're in the game, you're always guaranteed to have X number of items nearby you that you can, you know, pick up for crafting materials and stuff. And considering that there are trees everywhere, that definitely satisfies the requirements of having something that you can get crafting materials from. Although I would assume the fact that trees can't be cut down in this game, which is, I have to say that's kind of nice. I kind of like that. I wish Miss Survival would do, would maybe do that same thing, allow us to keep trees. It would be nice to ha be able to, you know, cut down some trees to do some kind of like landscaping, you know. But after a while, if you want to start building out your uh, your base and stuff, okay, we're gonna get I'm gonna get up on the shore and try to run back to some of the areas I've already cleared out. It's just taking so long. Okay, so we got eight here and we got two more at the base. That's ten. I need two more clams. And, yeah, I mean, looking at that little, I got my little diver's dream over there. I put that up there so when I want to go down to the under underground cavern, I can go up there and kind of situate myself, get all my gear swapped, you know, put on the, um, the scuba gear and the, and the air tanks and then go down. I mean, you could you can change it like when you're floating in the water you can swap from one to the other it doesn't take that long to do it it's just kind of nice to have something set up so I can just kind of just do it oh nice look at that look at that that's what I like person I don't think I mean maybe I'm wrong but typically I don't think you find clams in lakes I thought clams were mostly a an ocean and a sea thing. It's not something you necessarily find in a lake. So, I think it's kind of odd. Some of the things we find is kind of odd. Okay, looking good. Looking good. We're going to start to drown a little bit. We're too far down. <laughs> gonna have to get a bunch of hunting done man I need to get I need to what I want to do is I want to go off and uh, go hunting for as many rabbits as I can get my hands on mostly because I need claw and that's right now aside from oh god I'm holding down the run key please let's run 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 yeah I want that little bunny I want that little bunny yeah, that's that's off the side. That's that's not something. Let's not do that right this second. All right, let's see. So tempted to go over there and raid the uh, hunters. I mean, they're so close to my base. I've I've had them get well, not terribly close, but I've had them get. I've had them like over the beach over there. And oh fucking hey! Oh, they fuck you! Eat my oh, you motherfucker! You fucking came after us! Oh god damn it! Oh, Jesus Christ. I know. That's a little bit too much swearing. Where is he? Oh, there's, we gotta get, we gotta get revenge for that. Where? I 
I don't know if it was you, but oh my lord. What the hell? I mean, that was just, I don't, I don't get that. I don't get how the heck in the world. I mean, we were swimming out there for quite some time. Yeah, that was a little too much swearing. That was, that was, uh, probably a little bit too much on the swearing. Yeah, um, I wasn't expecting it at all. Clearly wasn't expecting it, and I kind of freaked. We should have pulled out the shotgun, because we were still above the water, and we could have used it to kill him before it killed us, but nope. Nope. We kind of freaked a little bit. Oh, look at those, like, there's three of them right here. Three of them right here. One. Give it, give it. Oh, we're gonna, we're gonna take some damage. Definitely gonna take some damage. Two. Okay. Three. Oh, this is ticking. Okay. Okay, we can't, we can't use it. Oh, can't use that underwater. Come on, come on, we can make it. We can make it without drowning. Don't drown, don't drown, don't drown. Oh my lord. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right. Everything's looking good there. Let's see. We got 11 of them. I think there's a clam right there. I'm going to I just want to have more. I just want to get it try to get as many as I can. Where did that stupid he must have been swimming out here already, and he's, he must have been chasing something, and then he got close to us, and he's like, oh, I can go attack that. And then he attacked us, and, and I, I flipped out a little bit too much. I didn't get the shotgun, and that's, yeah, that was, uh, yeah, that was bad. All right. Oh, that was a uh, little bit more of an adventure than I wanted. Okay, there's another clam. Yeah, that uh, he must have been swimming out here. He must have been like, no, that's not a clam. Right? It's hard to tell if that's not a clam. But... Yeah, he must have been already out here swimming, chasing something. Like, he probably chased after a deer, and the deer outswam him. And then he just happened to be right here. And he's like, oh, there's a human. That looks even better. And he came after us. Hey, I see you over there. I see you. I definitely see you. No? Oh, yeah. Yeah, take that. All right, all right. That was okay. Okay, we we, we need to just cool down a little bit. All right, we're gonna be fine. We're okay. Um, let's see. We need. Okay, I know we already have twelve there. We don't need that. We're gonna need you. Really leave you there. Oh. Get out of this menu. Okay. Probably cook something here. I need to make something to eat. Yeah, I do need to make something to eat. Maybe we'll just let this run out. And... Yeah, it looks okay. Alright. So we got that done. We got enough of this. Let's go numb some of that. Drink some of that. And I think I will... Throw a couple steaks on oven. Let's see. Yeah, let's just do those two. Put you there. Put you there. Got to make some clean water. All right. Remember, don't forget that you're cooking something. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
there. That was that was everything. That was everything there. Alright. Trying to go tend to my plants. Let's see. Split you in half. Are you there? And that goes in half. That goes right there. Probably need to go run and get a whole I heard the sound of fishing. I heard the sound of someone fishing. There could be someone outside of our base. Alright. Alright, give me a second, man. There's somebody outside there. We're obviously going to have to confront them. Obviously going to have to confront them. Because if we don't, they're going to attack us anyway. Shoot. I need... I've been thinking about creating a ceiling with the drop-down ladder. I swear to God, I heard the sound of somebody casting a reel. Like they were fishing. I did. I heard something. Alright. Alright. We can't have hunters over there. We simply can't have them over there. They're, they're going to be a problem. I just know it. They're going to get too close. We're going to get too close. And it's going to turn into a fight. And you know what? I want to make the fight on my time. Not on theirs. We're, that's it. Yep. Yeah, we're going over there. We're going to go over there and get rid of these guys. Can't have that. Okay, that's looking pretty good. Um, yeah, let's go over here with it. Alright. Let's see. Got that over there. Dirty, I'm just going to... Not going to worry about this right this second. Starting to get kind of late. Yep. Yep. Something, something's going on over here. I don't know what. Okay, we got six of these. Got six of those. And I need, I want to make two of these. I should make at least one of them. And we're missing this. And we also need to get something. Let's see, what do I got over here to have? Got 107. There's the extra. Okay, let's see. Split in half. There we go. Let's go get that filled up a little bit. What was it? Is 150 mass that we needed? No, just 100. So we're going to go to one. Alright. Just go let that run. Those guys are too close. Those guys are too close. There's got to be. There's got to be a confrontation. You can't have those guys over there like that. I can hear them in my base. That just says to me, "Yep, they're too close for comfort." All right. I know we hit that base over there not too long ago. Hopefully, we don't have a lot going on over here. Right. We're just gonna we're just gonna rush him. I'm just gonna rush him and come out blazing. Just gonna come out blazing, boys. I didn't say switch it. Come on, he reloaded. Ah, oh, I fucking switched my... God damn it. Stop hiding behind the tree. God, I'm hitting this. Run, run. Yeah. Yeah. 
Good lord, I hit... See, that's why I like to just stand there and just let them hit me while I'm shooting them. Because that's just ridiculous. I mean, I couldn't have missed... How many times did I miss? <laughs> it's too ridiculous. Oh my lord, that was ridiculous. Oh my lord. Yep. Yep. Yeah. That's why I don't traditionally just try to, you know, bob and weave and stuff. Because I know I'm I know that that's gonna happen. I know Damn it, what did I click to No. I could do that. Jeepers. See, when things go like that, when things go fast and furious, my fingers are like, I'm like mashing multiple keys at the same time, switching things on and off in my hands, and it's a mess. It's why, for me, the best thing is just stand there, take a licking, make sure you get good clear shots off at them, kill them. And just deal with the repairs later because otherwise it's just I'm just gonna be I'm just gonna be wild wild and all over the place all right so I made one that's good it's getting later yeah I'm sorry about that I get a little bit worked up it's one of the reasons why yeah I just stand there and and take it to the face because other than that it's just too much I start shooting wildly because I can't aim because I'm moving. With this game, you gotta be very accurate or forget about it. Or you're just gonna hit everything. Yeah. Alright, so. I'm gonna go fill this with water. And that should take care of that. And I got. Another one of these, I can put that there. Got this, we're just gonna put that there. Let's go get some water. Oh, that was nuts. That was a little bit much. Alright, I think we're looking fine there. Oh, sounds like it went out. Okay. Sounds like the wood burner went out, which is fine. Yeah. Alright, good. More potatoes. Let's see, what do we want? I got a ton of those. Let's do more of these. It's, it's, yeah, let's just do that. I don't know. The smartest thing would be to just do nothing but potato or tomatoes. Because they're the best bang for the buck. But um, I like to see some variety in there just because. Every once in a while I do make dishes, but I usually don't. Yeah, we want potatoes because then we can make um, Molotov cocktails, you know. We'll get that stuff done. Alright, so. Let's see. Let's just, let's just put it right here. Alright, power per second getting late. Let me see. Yeah, I think the sun's sun's right there. It is getting ready to go down. We're going to find a better place for it than this. I'm just going to put it here. Okay, so we can definitely upgrade consumption. Oh, circuit boards. Wait a second. We could just upgrade this I'm going to need that. Yeah, we can upgrade this right now. Dude, let's just upgrade it right now. I don't need two of them right now. 
Okay. Um, I think you're over there. And I need some rope, right? I'm gonna need rope. Cool. update wonder if I just turn that off and on okay point 24 okay give me a second we want to need to get 80 more just gonna split this in half there we go that should definitely get us high enough so we can do one more Okay, so it's 24, point 24, upgrade that, okay, point 0.18, oh, look at that, see the heat coming off of it, let me turn it off real fast, okay, so it's 10 degrees now, and 25, with that on, 21, 25, 21. I'm going to assume if I'm outside, <laughs> it should, it should reach me. Okay, five degrees difference. And if I'm over here, 23. Not bad. All right, let's get a light on here. Can't jump up on that. Probably hit, I'm hitting my head on the ceiling. <laughs> okay. Okay. Wow, look at that. Sixteen degrees. K okay, twenty from right here. It's not like I'm gonna do spend time over here. I mean, this is just, this is just a storage room. Oh, oh, we gotta go upstairs. We gotta go upstairs. Yep, got windows on everything up here. 15, 14. 14. Alright. 14 degrees right there. Now, this is not winter. Alright. Hopefully we're... Okay, 14 degrees. 18. Come down here. 25. So it's always 25 here. No matter what. Oh. Uh, wonder. Wonder what should we do. Maybe it should be moved there. Should I. I'm gonna. I think I need to extend my building. So I can move some of the stuff over there. I would like to move this right over there. And then. I like to have, I want to have, with well, a stove, the refrigerator, and the wood burner, obviously, together. Okay, so, we, okay, so we've seen what this is like. Yep, the video's getting a little long. Let's turn it off. Oh, it's six degrees. It's three degrees. It's getting cold. It's getting cold. Flame on. All right. Thirteen degrees. Give it a little bit. It's got to go up more than that, right? Right? Is that it? 13 degrees? That's all the better. Oh, that wood burner. 3 degrees, 2 degrees. 3 degrees, 1 degrees. Yeah, if I have... Yeah, I know that a wood burner probably is mostly for just burning wood. All right. 22 degrees. 22. Right on it. 22 degrees. 
17, 14. Yeah, I think we got to have a couple of these. One at both end. Like, put one right here. And then when we extend the building over here, we put one right over here. 13. Yeah, it's definitely going down. Definitely going down a little bit. Okay, so I guess that's that's that. I'm going to just turn that off. I don't need to have two of those on. Okay, there we go. We got a radiator. I am going to get another radiator put together here uh, pretty soon, probably tomorrow in the game. And, yeah, um, this looks like a pretty good deal. It doesn't use up a lot of electricity. Uh, at night, it's obviously going to be a lot of electricity. But we've got... Well, this says point four out, even though, let's see, point one one, okay, point two nine, and then you got the light that's on. I don't think there's anything else on in here. So, okay, okay, so that's it for this video, guys. I just wanted to go through that whole thing of building a radiator. Uh, again, just sorry, got a little, I get a little uptight about the whole fighting thing. If I, uh, if I don't just stand there, set my feet and just aim and fire, <laughs> it, it just, my, my fingers are all over the keyboard. Everything goes nuts. Clearly don't have a steady hand at all. <laughs> this were actually a real survival situation. I would be dead on the first day because I can't shoot shoot straight i can't i can't hold a gun straight i can't hold it still okay so that's it for this video sorry it went a little bit longer but we got this put together we tested it the energy output is very reasonable so it's very easy to be able to have two of these things going as long as we have a ton of power and we don't have our power too low at the in the evening because you don't draw power during the evening you only draw power during basically during the day um, I think that's it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you later, dudes.